carries me, knowing the alignment is my salvation, the connection force to all of communication. I know I'm protected and provided, guided, because I declare it to be so. I believe it and thus I perceive it. I believe it and thus I see it in my life. Cause and effect universe. My consciousness makes a difference on this planet. In my very experience, which emanates out into my community, the same force as the sun exists within I. In all of us, the interconnected vision and the empowerment that sits at the center of each of us is our true essence, our true identification, which compels us and carries us, brings us to moments like these that I couldn't believe that I could one day achieve. Something inside of me lives, something inside of me sleeps, and I'm here for the activation of the one true education, mind frames changing across situations. I'm playing my role like I was just inventing my soul with each step. My birth process is this genetic encoding, genetic unraveling, unlocking here now. San Francisco, California, USF. St. Mary's Hospital. There is one essence and it prevails through each of us. We each detail and entail a different kind of message. For all the earth to see, we have to awaken now. It's our opportunity, this is our chance. There's nothing to be feared in death. Death is the beginning. Death is the most incredible ride that we could ever take in our lives, or so they say. But if it's done unto us as we believe, why not believe in the greatest achievement of our soul? Why not believe in what we hope to see? The limitations that we have over the consciousness that we are is limited to the sensations that we hold as a human being. But how many sensations more do we have than the five basic that were introduced to us as children? How much more of us is waiting in the, in the gates to emerge? My hypothesis is much, much more. And as we unlock it, in our, the very steps that we take as human beings, as we unlock it in the discovery of who we can become. It works with us. The essential core. The essential core works back into our essence and into the frequency of what we know. And so as I stand here and declare as the sun sets that humanity is ready for what's next, channel through me and penetrate all beings, great spirit, Know that at the center of all of us lives this one eternal message, this one eternal flame. Thus why I came to proclaim the name Sat Chit Ananda. The earth is ready to awaken, Great Spirit. Channel through me all that you want me to know. Channel through me everything that you need such that I may become my greatest essence and your message delivered to its greatest potential. I declare this to be so. I declare this to be the realization and the reality of my life and I let it go into you, Great Spirit. Namaste. And so it is and so I let it be. This is me, Sean Lally, trying to be free. San Francisco to wherever you are. 2011, the door is ajar. This is the portal we've been waiting for. This is the portal we've been waiting for. Walk through it. Awaken now to your truest essence. Awaken now because the time is a present. Awaken now because you're alive to do this. This is our next step as humanity. Let's prove it. Let's walk in conjunction, creating a new culture and reality. The time is now. We are the totality. Everything that is, is an extension of who we are. Everything. Everything that we perceive is a tool for us to use. Everything. And so let us use it. Let us use the tools at hand. 
Let us invent that which we could only plan in dreams. Let's combine as a universal species to invent the world in a way that works for everyone. In a culture and a society that improves the souls of others, not breaks them down. This is our essence and opportunity. Let us shine now, forever hold our peace. And forever hold our peace in the heart center where all things are unlocked. Connect now. Connect and know your salvation. Align with your inner being and connect to the universal soul, the universal dream. I want to stay.